Hey guys, back again with another episode of Cigars in the Car. And for this episode, we're gonna be, I'm gonna be smoking something that I've really wanted to show you guys. Um, it is Al Capone Sweets Cognac Dipped Cigarillos. Uh, I've been wanting to do a Cigars in the Car for a long time now, but as usual, just don't really get around to doing it but we're back so we're gonna not waste any time just get right on in comes packaged uh, kind of interesting um, let's open this up it's like a, I don't know what that is hmm Ooh, you know You know what? They smell pretty damn good. You know, it smells like, uh, just literally smells like cognac and cigar. And they're very small, as you can see. Dry draw, like a lot of, uh, gas station cigars, is kind of like a graham crackery, uh, taste. but it leaves a nice cognac flavor on your lips. So that's pretty cool. Uh, forgot my Bic lighter, so I'm using matches. Let's just get right in. Okay, so right away, jeez, it's a very, very mild flavor, very mild tasting cigar, um, and it tastes pretty good. Um, but it's got kind of a cigarette-y taste to it, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, honestly, it probably uses the same tobacco as in a cigarette. They just put a different wrapper on it and put cognac flavoring in it, but... But believe it or not, it actually doesn't taste bad. Like it's not a it's not, you know, a dirty flavor on the retro hail or anything. It's very smooth. Uh it's not harsh in any way. Um It's pretty good. You know? That, <laughs> there's nothing wrong with it. Look at the ash though. I don't know if you can see that. There's like those white dots on it. I don't know what that is. Maybe some of you do. Lots of good smoke, um, pretty thick, but yeah, it's not bad at all. Um, oh man, I mean construction, you know, constructed better than like the full size gas station cigars you could say. Um, and other than that, it, there's not much to it, it actually tastes kind of plain. There is a, a, a hint of cognac especially on the lips. Uh, but then other than that, it's kind of just like a cigarette-y, cigar-ish taste. Uh, that's kind of it with this thing. Definitely not bad though. And you know, these things aren't ridiculously expensive. Um, I mean, you get, I think you get, oh, well, you get 10 of these for $6, or I paid $6.99 for this, so you get 10 for $6.99, not bad, um, and I would definitely smoke these, like, if I were just fishing, and I just wanted a quick little cigar, 
this would be a really good choice. You know, I really like the Davidoff Cigarillos, which is basically this, just it's Davidoff and it's not flavored. Those are really good. Um, and gosh, I think you get 20 of those for, again, like uh, $20, $22 or something like that. So a lot more expensive, but you're actually getting more than you are in these and they're a lot better. But you know, for cheap, just quick cigar, this would be great. You know, smoke break cigar, you know, again, a fishing cigar, anything like that. Uh, pretty good. It's not bad. I really like it. The only problem is that is definitely cigarette tobacco. It's definitely cigarette tobacco in there. Um, and you know, that's a real wrapper on there. I think that that is a real wrapper. Uh, cause you can always tell by the ash, it's a white ash, but, um, if this were paper, it would just be like a white gray. This is, you know, not quite, and it's a rougher texture. So I think that's a real wrapper on there, but yeah, the biggest drawback is the tobacco, definitely cigarette tobacco, but thankfully we're not inhaling these. I definitely don't recommend you do either. Not good, not bad. Good little cigar. Um, and this really isn't a gas station cigar. I'm sure some gas stations sell them. I had to go to a smoke shop for them, so. But hey, they're not bad. Um, and I'm trying to cut these videos shorter, guys, so. You know, that's kind of all I have to say, you know. Overall, it's just a good little cheap uh, cognac dip cigar. Not bad at all. I like it. Um, that'll be the end of this video guys and uh, I'll see you next time.